What's going on everybody? Skate Don't Hate 96 on YouTube here. And um, I have a really cool, exciting video for you guys today. Um, and I will start off by just showing you this box. Um, so this is the box that I have. Um, can you see it? There it is. So this is the box that I have. Um, this is the side, the bottom, the other side, and the back. So if you can tell what it is by just the box, then good for you. Um, and it is the box of the Odd Taste MVP. So what this means is I have picked up the Odd Taste MVP. So I got this today, um, and it came. Well, first of all, let me just tell you about it. So the Odd Taste MVP is obviously not like my old one. My old one broke. My old one was a little pin about this big, um, about this big, or no, probably about okay about this big and it was just a little pin is about this thick and it had a clear miser tank on it and it was an ego T so that's about all it was and it was nothing crazy nothing special and it broke and you know that's the second time it's broken and I was just tired of having to get new parts for it because they just just didn't seem worth it because you know they don't last forever and you know what's the point so I went to a vapor shop at my local mall and picked up the I taste MVP. So the I taste MVP obviously does not look like my old one. If you had seen my old videos, you can tell this does not look anything like it. It's a little, uh, it's a little silver box, stainless steel silver box. Uh, you charge it at the bottom here, and you can use this to charge a lot of things. Um, and it's really awesome, you know. Um, you can charge. You charge it here. You can put it into a USB. Um, and it's just awesome. So I'll tell you a little bit about it. So the main thing that I got this for was the variable wattage and voltage. So what you do here is to control the wattage, you press this little U down at the bottom. Can you see that? Yes. So you press this little U at the bottom, and it shows up how many hits you've taken. And then it pops up your wattage as of right now, and I'm vaping on 4.5. So that's my wattage, or my voltage, sorry and my wattage hold it down at the P here hold the P down shows how many puffs you've taken and then it shows your wattage and my wattage right now is at 10 so this goes up to let's see I think it goes up to um, 11 so I'm at 10 so that's what the wattage goes to the voltage goes up to I think 6.6 .6 maybe um, let's see here. Okay, it goes up to 5. Well, anyway, so I'm vaping at 4.5 volts, and um, that seems to be working very well for the juice I have in here. Um, and then, again, my wattage is 10. So, those combined make this a really good vape for this uh, e-liquid. Um, and you can test it out with different wattages uh, because the lady at the store was telling me each liquid has a little honey spot, uh, which makes it vape better, taste better, and just you know overall makes the vaping better. But if you go too high on wattage or voltage, you can burn the liquid, burn the wicks down, and that's no fun because you just have to get new ones. And it just burns the liquid and it tastes disgusting. Um, so the atomizer on here is a iClear 30 uh, clearomizer. With uh, has about holds about three milliliters max, uh, with a adjustable drip tip. As you can see there, and it goes just spins around on a little ball. And yeah, I just usually keep mine straight up because I like you know just the simple looking. I like, oh, it looks clean to me. But anyway, um, it's a really good vape. Uh, I, uh, I enjoy it a lot right now. Right now I'm vaping on some blackberry. Um, and it's delicious. Um, so what else comes with this um, kit is a little. I'll open it up here for you. Um, so in the kit, it comes with obviously the thing that holds the eye taste, um, and it comes with a instruction manual, and it comes with a little other slip of how to fill up each different atomizer that you can get with your eye taste. So it has a way to fill up the iClear 10 clear miser, the iClear 16 clear miser, the iClear 16B clear miser, and the iClear 16D clear miser. And on the other side, 
it has how to fill the iClear 30 clear miser, which is this, um, the iClear 30S clear miser, and the iClear 30B clear miser. Um, so that's kind of cool. It has a really good, um, uh, really well put um, instruction manual, owner's manual in here about everything that goes on. So you can see this. It's just a really well organized and easy to learn manual. I didn't need to use it because the lady at the um, store told me how to use it and I got it all figured out. Um, and it also comes with this little plastic tip that you can put on your tip. Um, I don't use them. I don't see a point. Uh, but I would definitely recommend getting one of these. I'm in love with it. I really like the way it vapes. Um, it was only $70 um, at my store plus $4 for the juice so $75 about in all and um, this is the e-liquid um, it's Hengson for all e-smoking devices uh, and this is 18 milligrams of nicotine um, and you know it just has all the stuff on it expiration dates warning labels all that stuff and the ingredients here are propylene glycol which is you know sugar vegetable glycine flavoring um nicot or what is that uh flavoring nicotine yeah that's about it so vegetable glyc glycan glycine uh propylene glycol i don't know if i'm pronouncing these right or not probably not but you know you guys understand what's going on um so i definitely love this stuff so um <clears throat> Let me turn my fan off real fast um, so I can show you guys how this thing vapes. Um, so I'm still getting used to it. So, you know, I'm not going to have huge clouds right now because I don't want to burn it. I don't know. You know, I'm just still getting used to what the uh, wattages I can go up to are without burning it and just seeing how well it vapes. So another thing is when you hold the button down, let's see if I can get you guys to see this. When you hold the button down, it shows a little green thing. When it's fully charged, there's no green at all. Uh, that's what the lady told me. Um, so this is, you know, obviously not fully charged. Uh, when it's halfway, you know, going down, draining the battery, it turns yellow. And then when it's about to be dead, which is when you really should fill it up, uh, is red. Uh, so the thing will turn red, yellow, and green. Green is fully charged. Yellow is half charged. Red is about to be dead, and you need to charge that son of a bitch. So anyway, I'll hit this thing for you guys and see show you guys how it vapes a little bit so here we go so that was a little bit of it hold on let me try again and that's about it guys so it's really good I'm not going to take huge hits off of it because I'm still getting used to it obviously but I really do love this thing. It's great. The blue, the blackberry is delicious. Um, so I'll show you guys the bottle. Uh, it just says e-liquid hangsin. I think that's how you say it. Hangsin, 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 whatever. Uh, this is the bottle that comes in. Let's show you guys. See if you can see it. Kind of. Um, but it's really good. I definitely recommend it. Let's go check them out. Uh, the other liquids I have still left, uh, which I need to get some more probably soon, is that uh, Purple Haze that I still have and Mango. And those are, this is the Mango, this is Mr. Max Guy Vape. Um, so these are the e-liquids that I have right now. I definitely need to get some more soon. Um, but again, the iTaste MVP, I definitely recommend it. It's got great reviews everywhere. Um, if you live in Durham, North Carolina, and you live near Northgate Mall, I would definitely recommend going to check out Nick Fix. Um, that's where I got this. Um, and if you go, uh, tell them my name, and uh, I can, you know, that, that'll benefit me and it'll benefit you. So, Northgate Mall, Durham, North Carolina. Go check it out. Nick Fix. Tell me, tell them my name. My name is Thomas Scott. Go tell them that, and it'll help all of us out. <laughs> so anyway, um, I taste MVP. I clear uh, atomizer. I clear 30 clearomizer. Um, and the I taste MVP. So that's about it, guys. Um, if you like the video, give me a like. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. If you have any questions or comments, comment down below. Send me messages. All that good stuff. I hope to see you guys soon. Have a great summer. And yeah, be safe and keep vaping. Later, guys.